The monumental project came with a hefty price tag of $1.45 billion, marking it as the longest cross-sea bridge in Southeast Asia. This collaborative endeavor between China and Malaysia encountered a myriad of challenges throughout its construction. Penang, a pivotal area for Malaysia's economic expansion, has experienced a population influx that has severely congested the Penang Bridge, the sole previous connection to the mainland, where more than 100,000 vehicles wait in line daily. In response to the growing traffic woes, the Malaysian government greenlit the construction of a new, 22.5-kilometer bridge originating from the southern part of the island. The bridge design incorporates both a land approach and a significant sea-crossing segment. This sea-crossing section features an intricate three-span, double-tower, cable-stayed bridge, along with a 16-kilometer box girder bridge supported by a staggering 586 piers. Due to Malaysia's nascent bridge construction capabilities, the country was unable to undertake the project alone. Consequently, the government allocated the intricate sea crossing segment to the China Communications Construction Company, CCCC, while local contractors managed the land approach. However, the region's distinctive climate and natural environment pose considerable technical hurdles, even for seasoned experts like CCCC. To guarantee the bridge's stability and longevity, over 5,000 piles were driven deep into the seabed, reaching bedrock, with the main span piles extending to depths of 120 meters. A critical concern arose from the main bridge pier's proximity to a vital shipping channel used by 100,000-ton cargo ships, significantly increasing the risk involved in the construction process. The threat of a collision was ever-present, with potentially catastrophic consequences. Thankfully, skilled Chinese engineers took proactive measures, encasing the pier bases in robust steel casings and pouring specially formulated concrete resistant to seawater corrosion. This meticulous approach ensured protection against erosion and safeguarded the integrity of the piers. To expedite construction, an offshore concrete mixing facility was established. Yet new challenges emerged during the casting of the piers. Malaysia's tropical rainforest climate, characterized by relentless heat, posed a risk. When water is mixed with cement, the resultant heat can induce cracks in the concrete, jeopardizing the bridge's durability. In response, engineers innovatively incorporated ice into the concrete mix and embedded cooling pipes within the pier bases to circulate cold water, effectively reducing the temperature of the concrete during the curing process. These clever solutions ultimately triumphed over the obstacles, and after an arduous 48-hour effort, the workers successfully completed the pier bases.